To understand the future, we have to understand one fundamental truth. Nature is technological. If we understand that, if we follow that narrative all the way through from our primordial beginnings to the future and where we're headed, you'll understand that we, we are living in a false narrative. We live in the false narrative that we are human beings, when in fact, we're nature. We are nature. We are a byproduct of a rock flowing through the cosmos. So why do we have a culture of crisis now? The philosopher Terence McKenna once said that culture is not your friend. And I think what we're finding now is that this is absolutely true. Culture is not your friend. So why is it that we are so desperately connected to culture, modern culture. And I think part of it is because we have this feeling of isolation that's happening right now because we can augment and mediate our appearance and we can show the world how we want to be perceived. I spend most of my time talking about the future and digital philosophy. And what I've come to see is that we've lost touch with the fact that we are nature, that we are not just an extension, that we are literally nature. Why are we bound to the chaos that keeps being fed to us from every corner of culture? insecurity, isolation, malnourished emotional states. And you really have to ask yourself, what is the point? What is the point of projecting an image of success if internally your internal unconscious mind is in chaos? What is the point of that? You know, we have to go back to the source, which is nature. I can tell you that there are a couple of rituals that might help you as we move deeper into the future. One of those is silence. Letting there be space in between all of the noise that we create for ourselves. Because something interesting lives in that space. It's us. We live there. That secret self that only emerges occasionally for some people. Obviously for philosophers, it's um, something we pursue. It's something that uh, is the heart and soul of our work. And, you know, I, I say that I'm a techno philosopher, digital philosopher. What that really means is that I am looking at the next layer on top of cultural chaos. We've taken on this narrative that we are separate from each other and separate from nature. That nature is something that we need to dominate. Part of it is that we're all victims of a system that has been set up to make you into a product. You are not a product. And if you see yourself that way, that's the beginning of, of the ultimate isolation. Ultimate isolation comes from seeing yourself as a commodity. To be packaged, partitioned, separated, valued, devalued. We have forgotten who we really are, what we really are. Maybe that question was never fully answered. 
what I'm starting to feel, what I see now, is that we've lost touch with our original source. And culture and some technologies are pushing us further and further away from our original source. We are cosmic. We are nature. We are nature itself.